By the way, let me repeat what you said, yeah? So, the, our friend here, what's your name, by the way? Alf. Alf? So, our friend Alf is saying, the faith has to defend itself. Yeah, the it faith. Have yeah, meaning I don't need to be to defend. I don't need to explain. Yeah. It has to be clear. Yeah. So because if God loves us, God will send His guidance clear for everyone. Yes. Yeah. If you, He's knocking at the door, it says in the Bible, Jesus knocking yes. at the door. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. If you open the door here. But my point is, God, if God loves us, will make His message clear for us. Yes. Yeah. I've already, I told to someone who said the same exact thing. This is like a script. No, no, no. No, I'm, I'm telling you, I'm asking you. If God loves you. Where is that bloke? The bloke come. There's Wait, another bloke. Listen, leave, leave the other thing. I'm talking about you. It's the same word. It's the same word. Okay, my point is, it doesn't matter. I've already been through this. Okay, I know, I know. So what you are saying, since God loves us and wants the guidance for us, we'll make, make his message clear. He would never do that. So, so he'll make it vague. I'll tell you why. Because in the same way we see that Jesus took the apostles aside to tell them extra things that the crowds didn't get to know, because he knew the crowds were only following them for their miracles. Let me finish this. Good. I like and it. So God is selecting his, God, his yeah, people. And we say, so God yeah. is select, so no, God no, no, is not for everyone. Says, for said, people. Jesus says no one can come to me unless the Father wills. Okay. So unless the Father wills. So him. does that. Okay, let me ask, understand. So, does God select people whom He guides, or does God I'm guide not everyone? I don't believe in, I don't believe He selects arbitrarily. I believe that those who willingly, are, after being convicted by the Holy Spirit and being enabled by the Holy Spirit to accept the truth, I believe that once they have done that, that is by the. My, my point is to you: Will God make Himself available for people to be accepted? It, it take, That's what my point is. It takes you. Do something. So Jesus does it does, repent for the kingdom of heaven? Is that my man? point. I mean, why are you going around there? My point is, it's so simple. If God loves us, yeah. if God loves us, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. I already debated to Roger. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Same if God loves us, yeah, it's great. Will make His guidance clear for us. Yes. Well, where, where'd you get that from? What did you base that on? That's not an inherent logical conclusion. So it's not logical. Well, it's not, so God will it's make not it inherent. vague. It's not an so, inherent so, so God will make it vague. Will make it difficult to comprehend. Will make it so complicated. Only certain people will understand it. Yes. Oh no! It's, as, as so you well, can't, it can't no be both. The Holy Spirit. Not I'm talking about. I'm talking about the guidance. The Holy Spirit. So the either the is the guidance of God has to be simple and clear, or should be complicated. <laughs> it's, it's not a matter of pure intellectualism. It's a matter of what God enables you to understand. You cannot understand things of the heavens unless one of the heavens. So uh, let me let me rephrase the question. God so if you. I, so if someone who is illiterate person living in the Arab Peninsula, a herdsman of a sheep or a goat or a cow, someone who is a fisherman, you know, like the disciple of Jesus, someone who doesn't someone. know have nothing, doesn't have back, you know, doesn't have, doesn't need to go to Cambridge or to, uh, uh, or for example, to Harvard They're to understand. Simple. So it's preached on the streets. That's yeah. why we have preached. So uh, yeah, that's my point. So when you come to them to say to them, by the way, this is the concept of God. God is one. You have to believe and submit your will to His will. He's one. One. He's one created. Is it a created concept? One God. Is it a created concept? Your your view of oneness is not the same as Allah's oneness. You cannot perceive. What's, what is, what is the oneness of God? Well, my point is, is that that your your what you. Do you believe God is one, by the way? What, what my this is what I'm trying to tell you. So do, do you believe God is one? Let's let's because otherwise we're gonna be. Do you believe God is one? Yes. You, okay. United one, is okay. a better word. United is a better word. So it's not one. I, I'm not saying he's not one. He is one. So let's okay. One let's, God. let's use okay one. But your idea of one is a created concept. It doesn't matter what my idea. Leave one. my idea. I'm talking about your idea. But in the Quran it says that nothing of a created, nothing of the creation can perceive of the non-creation. Again. Leave, leave what the Quran says. I'm talking about the Bible, yeah? That's what I'm saying. It's the same thing. Okay. So, God is one according to you, yes? Well, you put the words in my mouth, yes. I'm not putting it's, the words yeah, in I'm, like, I'm like asking you. It's God. Is God is one? Yes. Okay, good. What's the problem? Okay. Now, when Jesus said this, me and the Father are one. Yeah. I and the Father are one. They are one? Equal? No, he says, I, I, I am in the Father and the Father is in me. He says, do you not believe that the Father is in me and I am in the Father? So they are one in purpose, not in essence. What do you mean, what's purpose? Which is the guidance of the people. What do you mean purpose? I don't get Which it. means that they, they have different hypostatic properties. They have different hypostatic Okay, roles. so they're not one. 
that's not no because he's talking about so the they're not one no, so no, no, no. so just a no, slide no, no, no. okay so just a slide when he said me and the father when that's he lied you're just you're just don't know where you've got that conclusion from so i'm asking when he said me and the father are one one in terms of what what did he say give me the verse and chapter you can read it in context me and the father are one tell me the verse number and chapter do you know you check it you see the bible what are you reading there what's this you want to have uh, cookies? No, I'm good. By the way, this no, cookie, dry. this cookie, no, by the way, this cookie, there is one here, there is a cream in the middle, and there is one here. So there are three in one. Yeah, it's like the Trinity. Partialism. This is Trinity. Partialism. And you eat it in one go. So this biscuit, I this man, biscuit. I this, I say shampoo earlier. Like this biscuit, months. this biscuit, and the cream, and the other biscuit, they are one. So we can so eat it John, together. You're talking about John, John 10. Yes. Right. I and the Father are one. Against the Jewish opponents picked some stones to stone him. And Jesus says to them, I have shown you many good works from the Father. For which of these do you stone me? So therefore, why is he being stoned for the works of the Father? So, is he and the Father are one? Yes, that shows that their will is in one. Purpose, in purpose or essence? They're one in essence. They share an essence, divine essence. So they're in essence? They share a divine essence, a divine being, they're one being. Good, good. I, I, I like this, I respect this. Okay. So Jesus is all powerful, yes? In, in his, yes, he shares the divine essence. The divine essence will hold the power. The persons, the hypostases do not hold power because they get the power from the being they're in. In the same way, I as myself, right, as a transcendental, I as myself don't have the power to punch, but it's rather in my human nature I have the power to punch. So. <laughs> do you understand what I mean? Attributes. Yeah, you get audio. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So basically, <coughs> basically, yeah. What you are saying, Jesus, yeah, Jesus, as a human being, yeah, Two is not all powerful. Fully, fully human and fully divine. So is he so, fully human, fully divine? This is fully human and fully divine. In Colossians chapter chapter two verse nine, it says, "For in him dwells the the fullness of the Godhead bodily." Okay. So when Jesus said the question, is he all knowing? Is Jesus all knowing? Do you yeah. agree with it? He's all knowing. Yes. Yeah. Are you going to bring up the hour? Yeah. Don't bring up the hour. Don't yeah. bring up the hour. Yeah, I'm, I'm bringing it up. Do you, do you know, I'm going to bring it up. Do you want to explain it now? I explain it. Explain it. So there's there's three interpretations of it, but the best one. Best one is the interpretation of marriage. Can I, can I, you know can, I marriage? can I ask you a question? I need. I don't want your interpretation. I don't want the priest's interpretation. I want the Bible to interpret it. I don't do solo scriptura. I can give you interpretations. From, I I use Katina. I I, I use um. I'll show you. Just so you can validate. I use this and I have. No 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 no. no. I don't want. I don't want your interpretation. It's not mine. This is I don't want a priest's interpretation. No no. I want the Bible to, you said, you said initially, he said, So the scripture is a heresy. You said, one second, you said the Bible defends itself, yes? I said the faith sure. defends itself. No, no, you said the Bible. I said the faith defends itself. We know, we know. Well, I said he, the, said, he said, the Bible. Even though I do, I do affirm it does. Okay, good. My, my point, that's not my point. I need the Bible. It's a different context. You're, I need the Bible to defend this concept. You're, you're mixing up words now because you just obviously no, no. equivocated that to sola scriptura. Listen, doesn't mean it doesn't mean the interpretation of every single I need, is valid. Listen, listen. I need the Bible. The Bible cannot interpret yeah. itself in the same way okay. if I'm interpreting so the Bible. Good. So the Bible that wouldn't work. So the Bible is deficient to defend itself. No, no. Okay. So the Bible is complete to defend I'm itself. I'm saying my interpretation is deficient. No, I no. am the deficient. Okay. Person. My point is when Jesus said this statement, that's how it is. No one knows about the hour except the Father. Neither the Son. Meaning the sun, you are saying the sun in human form doesn't know about the hour. Who said this? This is your Did interpretation. I say that? He said neither the sun nor the angel. No one knows about the hour but the father. Yes, this is the Bible. How the the sun knows about I can the hour? Explain it trinitarianly as well. If well, you I believe in the monarchy of the father, then that he is the first. You're an analogy. No, no, I'm not. Worst, no, 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 I, no, no. I, I will give you the answer, and you will just if you don't I'm like the answer. I'm not interested with your with your analogy. Okay. I want to. No, no, no. A Bible this is not an analogy. This is this is Bible. Okay. I'm talking about the Bible. So Bible, which verse? Okay. Let me check. Which verse? I can give you a verse. Okay. The Trinity. No, no, not the Trinity. I'm talking about. I'm talking about. Well, I'm talking about Trinity. So Hebrews. No right? one knows about the Father. No one knows about the hour except the Father. Yes, but I, I'm explaining it yeah, in our theology. So in the monarchy, the Father, if the if the Father is the first cause, the monarchy, he is the 
He is the um. That's an energy. That's energy. That's not the Bible. It's not energies. Energies. That's energy. energy. Not a, oh, not and, the Bible. And that, no, it's not. It's doctrine. Because I hold to doctrine. I hold to church doctrine. This is my point. Eastern Orthodox. Okay. Okay. I don't do script, Holy Scriptura. I don't do. I don't play with that. My point is. Because it's how you twist when, the Bible. Okay. Me. When Jesus said. No, I just want to get to my point because I, I need I need to answer this one. The father being the first actuator, the first cause, right? For lack of a better word, being the first cause. Therefore, so the son is not the, the first cause. Good, I'm interested. The first rule. So the first cause is the father, not yeah, the but, son. But, but, okay, the, good. The notions explain this. So the son, the son is forgotten of the father by its process of filiation. We can distinct them such as the the Holy Spirit because it proceeds from the father eternally, whereas the son. Where is this in the Bible? I can show you, just, so, thou art my son, today I've forgotten thee. What? Thou art my son, today I have forgotten thee. So, the, so which is this in Gospel of John, yes? No. The only begotten son, yes? Gospel of John, yes? No. Are you talking about Gospel is, of John? No, this is taken from where? I always read okay. it. Psalm, Psalm, Psalm. Okay. Psalm 2-7. Thou right. art my son, this day I have forgotten thee. Psalm 2-7. Psalm, right. Psalm so, came a thousand years before Jesus. Okay, good, good. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's, that's nice. Yeah. I'm sure was so, right. so here, you are saying the son, yeah, the son, is equal to the father. Yes. What do you mean? I've just read the son out, and I the just, father. I want. I just read out, "Thou art my son this day. I have forgotten thee." This, this is. They're begotten me. Who's, so, the who's no, begotten? So, what's, what's that? Who begets who? Who begets the who? Who begets who? This is this is this is prophet who? Who begets who? The father begets the son eternally. He's eternally begotten of the father. So, who begets who? who, begets who? That, I've just answered the question. So, the father, father begets so the, the son. So, the father first. So, the Jesus comes second, yes? You are, so, Jesus is a creation. Yeah, you might, no, he's not creation. No, no, so, no, how is You said beget. Beget. Uh, beget means start. No, no, that's no, starting no, no, point. No, 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 that's What's the beget. That's, that's the word. <laughs> come on, come on. So come on, come on, come on. No, no, no. No, no, no. Justin Martyr says. Do you know what means beget? I will, no, you were talking about beget. Do you know what means beget? We will prove. This is what Justin Martyr says. Do you know, know what means beget? We will prove that we worship him reasonably, okay. for we have learned that he is the son of the true God himself. He holds a second place and the spirit of prophecy. So, second place. Obviously, a third. This is talking about how they, they uh, get their origination, right? Okay. From the Father. How they are begotten. All right. Okay, well, good. The son is okay. begotten and the, the Holy okay. Spirit okay. is proceeding from. One minute ago, you said the Father begets the Son, yes? Yeah, this, this is the father eternally begets the son. Okay. And the, no, no, no. The you know, there, is, there, the is not, the son. there is nothing said eternally. You understand? Listen, you did, didn't say that eternally. So you say. Oh, that's the what father, concept fallacy. No, no. That's you. That's uh, you. You bring me. Anything God does in that. No, no. no. You said the father begets the son. So the son has a starting point, yes? No. Because it's atemporally. So it doesn't have a starting point. A temporal, no. outside of time. Okay, listen, English, by the way, is not my English first language. Listen, 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 English is not my first language. I'm the Alpha and the Mega. But I understand what means of begets. Begets means before he was begotten, he wasn't there. No, you're, you're, you're so when the, when the father no. begets the son, it has a starting point. Am I right? No, because it's outside of time. By the way, it's outside of time. If by the way, who's, who's his can first language? Who's his English have a starting first point? language? I mean, if there is Can no believe. time for it, there to be a English is point. first language, yeah? There's so no... when someone begets something else, this something else which was begotten, does it have a starting point? If it is yeah. eternally begotten. Yes, at the beginning. It's a... Do you understand? Actually, you're just shooting yourself in the foot. No, I'm not. No, because you, you've, you've done a number of fallacies. No, no, no. no and no, you've no. straw manned my position. Because uh, I did not say that the son the is begotten temporally. He is begotten eternally outside who said this, of time. Who said, where is that? Where is that? In, 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 where is that go. eternally? There is nothing. Go. Listen, Here listen. Here we go. Yeah, okay. Read, John, read, read, read it again. You know John chapter no, one. Read it you again. No, no. Why was it not going? You know where I'm going. Read it again. John read it again. One. Read it again. No, no. Read it again. The beginning was the word. The word was with God, and the word was God. So beginning. So it has a beginning. In the beginning. In the beginning. So it has a beginning. If Jesus Christ is here, the beginning and the end. Uh, yeah, I'll give us that. So here. Jesus has beginning. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. You said in the right. beginning. No, it doesn't. Oh, let's use it. Repeat it. When it says in the beginning, it yes. means it means it in the means beginning before the foundations of the earth are created, which is nothing still, was created. That still has beginning. No, it's a temporal. <laughs> Unless you're God, I don't know why you're God in time. Come on, come on. Is your God in time? No, no, no. Listen. Is your God temporal? Listen, listen. You know what means beginning? Is your God, is your God in time? Listen. You're assuming temporal. Um, you're assuming temporal definition for beginning. Okay. Beginning doesn't have to be in temporality. What, Allah what, calls what, himself, what? Does Allah call himself the beginning and the end? No, does he? No, he, does. he goes to the first and last. Same yeah. thing. 
You know what's different? There's a difference. First, there is no, 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 no. This is logic. <laughs> okay, so if Anna is the first, you know what means first. Anna has a starting. You know what means first. So logic. Do you know the difference between first and beginning? Right. Let's get. Let's let's. Do you know the difference between first and beginning? According to what? According to English. According to English what? English, English language. Do you know the difference between first no, and I, beginning? I'm waiting. You can say. Do you know what means the difference between first and and, and, and beginning? Do you know? Do you know? Either point. you say you know. They're talking about the same thing. No, 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 no. The totally not the same thing. Do you know the difference between the first and beginning? Why? Is, what? What? You just get on with it. I'm letting you speak. I'm letting him speak. Like get even, on with it. What you're trying to lead up to. Listen. Either you know or you don't know. Just, just say. I'm, ask, I'm asking question. I cannot ask an answer. This is going to be a I could ask an answer. But I don't want. No, my point is. Either you know, say I know or you don't know. So you don't know. So you don't know. So you don't know. So you don't know. How can I argue with you if you're being logically Okay, good. Go back. I can't argue with you. Do you know the difference between beginning and the first? Word concept fallacy. So you don't know. So you don't know. So let's use people who are English speaking here, yeah? Please, the one who speaks English, his first language, raise your hand because they, they accuse me, someone who's his language, I'm English my second language, yeah? You've just deflected yeah, yeah. away from that entire Yeah, 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 that, that. You've just yeah, gone you away. Just, you just, you're so you've silly, you're talking about, I'll tell you what. <laughs> just... Ad hominem. So. Another fallacy. So, first means first, nothing before, yeah? Beginning has a starting point. That's a totally different thing. But doesn't first have a starting point? Because if no. Yes, it does. Because it no. Stresses a first is the starting point. But you understand it's because you're thinking the first eight First, morally. listen, listen. If I had something, like, if it, this is the first time I've kicked that sand, right? That no, a starting that's point. not English. Because you're thinking of it in time. I'm saying no, 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 you no. are addressing the word beginning yeah. in time. No, Therefore, beginning, no. Okay, let, okay, read it again. In so the beginning. Okay, in the beginning. So there is a beginning. So you, God, has a beginning, yeah? No. According to you, Jesus has a beginning, yes? No, because if you're going to apply that logic, your so, God has a beginning. So the question My is... My point is, is your logic condemns you, no, not me. Okay. Now, the other thing as well, begets as well, adding to this, begets. And talking about God begets a son. So the God, so the son is was eternally begotten. begotten. So what? Eternally begotten. There is no eternity. There is nothing mentioned eternally. Let's, let's work on if, if you tell me, if you tell me, there is nothing you know called eternity. Fallacy well, it doesn't matter. It does matter. Oh, what? fallacies don't you, matter. You are uh, no. Fallacies you, don't matter. Martin, doesn't matter. You hear it here and today. Fallacies don't matter, guys. If we're gonna argue, Mother, are you are you normally? Are, are, you, are, you, do you, are you? Does your brain normal work? This, this is ad hominem now. No, I'm asking you. Yeah, oh. this, is your brain normal well, work? Obviously, mine does so, because mine, mine actually understands a lot of logic. Good, good, doesn't. good. Okay. Let's, I mean, let's use, you, let's use, you, I've seen I'm, you I'm saying to you, uh, in the beginning, I said to you, you by the way, Bible, in the beginning, what do you, you in the beginning of our conversation, in the beginning, I told you, I'm not interested with your wording or your interpretation. No, I said to you, fallacy, when you are saying, fallacy. I asked you, I said, I'm, again, do I'm not interested to bring me your words. My point is, do you, is the word eternal starts with this? This is a, this is it's a specific eternal. word fallacy. No. If I tell you this is a specific word fallacy, it's a fallacy. No, it doesn't matter. It is a fallacy. No, 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 no. It is when you are adding, reasoning, no, when you it are is adding, fallacious reasoning. I cannot argue with when you. When you are adding, okay, when you are adding when words, when you are flawed. adding words to Jesus, oh, adding, that's, that's oh, your addition. Words. No, no. Do you understand? So, we have we have, have a God has a beginning. We have a God was begotten. We have a God that is not co-equal to the I Father. I hope the cameras have picked this up. We have a God, according to you, who is, who is He doesn't God. care about fallacies. I can't argue with someone who doesn't yeah, care about fallacies. I, I don't care about logic, your word. His logic is inherently flawed. I, I your don't logic care, is okay. flawed. I don't care about your word. I don't care about his logic being flawed. I don't care flawed. about your interpretation. I don't, I don't care about your words. your ideas. I showed him I used my point is, Tina. Yeah. Do I use See my here. interpretation? So I told him I don't go by what, what, you, what you said here. So you're beginning. sure manning. So you you got man. So you got so you got your God has a beginning. But this is what you said. This is what you understand. And by the way, we will leave the audience to decide. When we talk about in the beginning so, was the word, you're talking about at the point of creation. In the beginning was the word. Okay. Okay. So if if we can apply, do you know what means in the beginning? Do you understand? If you know I, what means in the beginning? This is you know what means in the beginning? I don't care about your definition. Okay. So here, the word, this is your the word was with God, word, yes? Word okay. This is an icy Jesus of the text. You need to conduct yeah. an actual exegesis of the text. Yeah. Understand the author's intent and not yours. Okay. But we can go back to the Greek. How okay. about we go to the Greek? I've been telling you. Let's phone. go back to the Greek. Let's go to the Greek. Okay, to the Greek. By the way, did Jesus speak Greek? 
Yes, yeah, he did. He spoke all languages. Nonsense. As God, he spoke all languages. He told did... to Pontius no, 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 Pilate no, 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 in Latin. No, 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 no. By the way, by the way, by the way. He spoke all languages. He's God. One second. One second. One second. The Jesus. I'm not talking about the God. I'm talking about Jesus. The Jesus. Yeah, that's Nestorianism. You're separating Jesus and God. They are already separated. You're separating. Them. He separated himself. He said, "Let it be not my will, but yours." Even in the Trinity, he's no separation. It's only by the way, by the way. This when thing's Jesus, not separate. By the way, this guy's Jesus, straw man in my position yes, constantly. Yeah. When Jesus he doesn't know was, anything about Listen, Christianity. when Jesus when Jesus was saying, let it be not my will, let it be, let it be not my will, but yours. Do they, Did share, he separate a will? Himself? Do they share a will? No, yes, they no, share a will. No. Yes, they share a will. That goes against, he doesn't want it. He said, take this cup away from me. Who's he's talking to you? Psalm. Is he not quoting the psalm? Can take, you read the psalm he's quoting? Yeah. Right. You, this, you see the point? He's straw man in my position he again. Said, Take you've already lost the debate because he you said, argued fallaciously. No, you can't say this. You've, you've, you, I can say this because it's true. You argued fallaciously. Your points were okay. all fallacy. Did Jesus so want to, to be crucified? This Did is Jesus... sophistry. Okay. He's a sophist. He's just trying to improve okay. the crowd. You could, by the way, I could ask. Uh, by the way, I could say other, other words about you, but no, no. I. I still, it's not, I still no, respect. I'm not saying about you, I'm no, saying about your logic. No, it doesn't matter. I I'm not saying about logic. your logic, other thing. I, I, yeah. I will call him out on fallacies. Yeah, yeah. I will call him out on fallacies. Yeah, yeah. I'm sorry you don't understand listen, what fallacies listen, listen. are, but when you learn what fallacies did, did are. Did Jesus want to be crucified? I can't argue with flawed logic. By the way, it is, did Jesus want to be crucified? I cannot argue with Did Jesus want to be crucified? I cannot argue with flawed logic. Did Jesus want to be crucified? Simple question. Did he want to be crucified? In the Bible, what does it say about Jesus Christ coming, with us, about the Son of God coming down? Look at this. What does it say? He's jumping. What does it say? He's jumping. I'm asking He's him. Jumping like when, he, when he, <laughs> the thing is, you have Jesus your wanted point. to be crucified. I cannot argue with you if you're being fallacious. Answer the question. Okay. Your points are you all fallacious. You could name me, could name me or the name yeah. from the world. I'm, I don't you care what you name me. You don't even know what the word fallacy means. Then Jesus wanted to be crucified. Jesus wanted to be crucified. Again. So Jesus didn't want to be crucified or he wanted no, to be crucified? I can't argue with you if you're not going to address the okay. last point. If my last, not the my last point, point is, did Jesus want to be crucified? Address the last point. He did says he wants to be crucified. crucified Jesus the flesh and Jesus the Did Jesus want to be crucified? Okay. So if he's going to straw man my position, which is fairly useless, I know you know what fallacy is, but I've seen you at least address people some for some sort of fallacy. Did Jesus him, want to be crucified? Answer, answer the question. Okay. I don't care about your, your words. Yeah. I, 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 still, I still, I still, I don't care about. I, I still, I don't care about your words. That's a big one. There is no Jesus debate. To be crucified. Yeah, okay. So Answer Jesus wanted it. to be crucified. Is machine gunning a question at me. Yeah, yeah, Jesus wanted to be crucified. My, they have one will. No. So yes. No. He yes. said, "Let it be not my will, he, but yours." Was he not That's quoting a psalm? Because I recall he was quoting a psalm there that prophecy may be fulfilled. No, but he said, "Let it be not my will, but yours." But, but, but you would overlook that, wouldn't you? No, because he doesn't. You're, want, you're taking literally. He did not want it to be crucified. It's a heresy, and you are committing that. He did not want it to be crucified. It's not, I told you this is your interpretation. No, he's. That's his oh. word. Let the Bible talk for itself. Jesus said, let it be not my will, but yours. So that's not his will. You, you see, your sly word games No, no, that's, work. Right. that's your, your word. sly word games don't You work. said that's... He I know says you the Bible. If Jesus person. crucified himself, it's a suicide then. He committed suicide if he goes to... So, no, no, no. You know what the problem is? Yeah. This is how it is. Yeah. You when you ask them, the when you ask them as follow, you said to them, did Jesus want to be crucified? He will say, they if, will anyone say knows eternally he wants, if anyone but knows what they're on about wants, in the crowd, not they'll in know. Eternity. And, and in eternity, the truth will speak for one. itself. <laughs> the truth will speak for itself. I, don't have, okay. I cannot debate with you anymore because no you are arguing in fallacy. That's fine. Fallacy. That's fine. But um, by the way, by the way, I would, I, I would by the way, to by the way, take a logic 101 I respect, by the way, I respect the passion that you are in. I disrespect the faith that you are in. I, dis I, yeah, disrespect, that's... I disrespect your, regard, your disregard yeah. of logic yeah. and fallacy. Yeah. The other thing as well, the other thing as well, when Jesus is talking about himself, he doesn't want to be crucified. He said, take this cup when away from me. So he doesn't want it. Right over the head. By the way, by the way, if, if I, I send... To, I don't hold to solar scriptura. <laughs> you don't know what solar By the way, means. if I send, for example, my brother here, if I send him to do a single task, which is to go to get a coffee from there, when he goes to that place and he didn't, he said, oh, please ask it's someone else. Logic. That's the only single task that Jesus has to do, which is to be crucified. Oh, but you have a separate will and you're a separate yet, being, so it's not a good uh, analogy. It's not a parallel analogy. When he came on earth, he, the last thing he said, take this cup away from me. Shaking but then after that, he said, his logic thought, let he doesn't it be know not what my will, but fallacy is. 
I'm done. I ask Allah to guide you. Seriously. May Allah guide you to the truth. May Allah guide you again. 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 Allah Allah guide you again. 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 When you see like this, people who are doesn't want to open just only their mind to the truth. You say to him, like these th these questions, by the way, that makes sense. When Jesus is his task, basically, according to them, is to be crucified on the cross. On the last moment, he will say, take this cup away from me. And not just when he was on the cross, is actually complaining to God. Why have you forsaken me? He was he was supposed to be crucified according to them. And may Allah guide him and Allah, may Allah bring us to the truth. And show us the truth that makes us to follow it. What is that? Allah Khairah.